Hi, my name is Abdur Rahman from Maple Systems, and I'll be going over the ASCII to hex ladder logic instruction in this video tutorial. Please review the hex to ASCII video tutorial before continuing this one. This tutorial will generalize many concepts based on the previous video tutorial. Now let's go over to an empty subroutine and place the ASCII to hex ladder logic instruction on the first rung. Now that we know where the instruction is and what it looks like. Let's examine screen number two and place the appropriate ladder logic subroutine on the right hand side. The ASCII to hex instruction will only execute when the coil B201 turns on. The ASCII to hex instruction basically takes in an ASCII character being two per register and outputs an equivalent hex value. So if I input the characters 41 in register D220, and 42 in register D221. According to our ASCII table, 41 is equivalent to ASCII character of A, and 42 is equivalent to ASCII character of B. So we will see 41, 42 as a hex equivalent, which is obvious, and the characters A, B as the hex's ASCII equivalent. Now let's go over to an HMC and review screen number two. So let's input the value 2B in register D220 and the value 2D in register D221. According to our ASCII conversion table, 2B equates to a decimal value of 43 and an ASCII character of a plus. A 2D equates to a decimal value of 45 and an ASCII character of a minus. This makes sense because the instruction converts an ASCII value input into a hex value output. So if I input a 2B as an ASCII character, well 2B is a hex value that corresponds to the character plus. Notice that the binary value for the register D220 and D221 and the binary value for register D232 they are different. Although the ASCII character and hex value may look the same, in actuality they are different values as distinguished by the binary representation of the respected registers. And this concludes our video tutorial for ASCII to hex ladder instruction. For further information, please contact Maple Systems or visit us online at maplesystems.com.